What has become of this city? There used to be laws, justice, not anymore. Crime is out of control, cats are missing, and townspeople are being victimized. Oh, hey, who pooped on my porch? What's going on with you? Whoa, whoa! We were supposed to protect those who couldn't protect themselves. You can get off my car, you little pecker! Now superheroes are torn apart by political differences. We are two sides at war. But war isn't going to save our city. Time travel is my only hope now. Myths tell of ancient times. When a new king united a kingdom torn apart by a powerful stick. Hi, hon. Shut up, man. There's no time to waste. I have to go back. Change the present if I can. Find this cat. And in doing so, Perhaps I can change what has happened to all of us. We should be happy that he's made friends in this town so quickly. We came here to hide. More friends just means more trouble. You're being paranoid. You need to lay off that stuff. It's changing you. Oh, lay off. It's the one thing that helps me relax from your stupid shit. Oh, hey, whippersnapper. Didn't see you there. Your friends are downstairs, kiddo. Get out there and play. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
if you just move to town and you get to be king, well, I think you're a little pussy. Go, King, go! Teach him a lesson, my lord! Let us battle! Oh, we changed the rules a little bit since yesterday. You gotta walk up to the bad guy. Before you can hit him, write well when you're using a melee attack. I'm not afraid of you and your strategic king combos. <laughs> Our king is undefeatable. Okay, really hit him this time, King. Blah! Ow! We can't stop him. Ready the guards of the Dark Court. Wow, did you see that? The King's amazing. His powers are unparalleled. You can't take us all on. Kids. Clear. As I was saying, you can't stop the king. He is all powerful. Oh my God! He defeated the dragon. No freaking way. That kid's amazing! Wow! Did you see that? The king's amazing! Maybe there's a way in through the garage, my lord! If there's a way in through the garage, the king will find it! Well, King Douchebag is such a skillful warrior! Did you see how he moved that ladder and used it to climb up? He truly is the most powerful king in all the realms! 
Holy fuck, he's amazing. I thought the king was going to do a sweet jump, but then he just did that. You're dead. Speak, Bard! What happened to the stick of truth? The wizard had it thrown into the ocean. Lies! You shall feel the wrath of the Moorish! Unhand him, you heathens! Release the Bard or you'll have the king to deal with! The king? They say he can slay a dragon with one blow. That's right! And if you don't... Uh, wait, wait, whoa, well, where is the wizard? Uh, I thought he was with you guys. Now we got a distress signal to come help him here. <laughs> Wizard is gone. My name is the kid. I'm from the future. Dude, we said we're not playing that anymore. Yeah, we're all split up. What's the point? This is the point. In my time, there is a massive crime wave and missing cats. I knew my only hope was to assemble the team. Hey, you can't switch games like this. Where's the stick of truth? Shut up, Kevin. This isn't about some dumb stick. There's a cat in trouble, and it's the key to finding the crime syndicate new to our town. In the future. Crime syndicate? That... That sounds too heavy for Coon and friends. Well, what do you want, Clyde? You want the fucking Freedom Pals to find the missing cat? Get the $100 reward and make their superhero franchise more popular? Fuck the Freedom Pals, dude. That's right. Poopsikins, there's a loud ringing coming from your basement playroom. The Coon Alert. Come on, Coon friends. Go get your stuff and report back to the Coon Lair. In the future, Coon and friends assemble. Sorry, guys, you can't play with us. We're playing superheroes now, and you guys are dorks. Wanna go play Star Trek? I'm Spock. We could all go to my house and sit around, staring dejectedly at our hands. I've been thinking about joining a gang. This might be just the kick in the pants I need. Hello, the boys are down in their little basement playroom. Oh dear, Eric and his friends are so imaginative. Sorry, crap. You pee. Donkey, Donkey balls. balls. Oh, did you get locked out? I'm afraid little Eric put a lock on the door to keep me out. I'm sure he has the passcode written down here somewhere.
officer, somebody appears to have put lava in front of my door. Well, no, it's not hot, but my son told me I will burn to death if I try and cross it. Uh-huh. Oh, yes, he did tell me that if I step on a crack, it would break my mother's back. It won't. Fuck. You. Mom. Maybe we should go to Reasons and see if the waitresses know anything. That's not enough, Mosquito. We have to act fast before the Freedom Pals can. A hundred dollar reward. Do you know what that could mean to our superhero franchise? That cat looks pretty old. Maybe it just died in the gutter somewhere. Humankind, do I have to remind you that as of right now, Freedom Pals have a hundred followers on Instagram? We have six. The five of us and Billy Turner, who's a ginger. This is the key to finally beating those fuckers. But where do we start looking? That cat could be anywhere. We need to split up. Mosquito, take to the air and check out all the city parks. You got it. Mosquito, away. Human kite, see if the cat is stuck up a tree somewhere. You've got the storm drain, Super Craig. Super Craig. Fast pass, I need you to use your superhuman speed to get to the mayor's office and tell her we're on the case. Don't worry, Coon. You can count on fast pass to get there. Excuse me. Hey, 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 hey! Do not touch that! That device can blow up the entire Milky Way galaxy! Jesus, fuck! Mom! The new kid is trying to play with the cube of ultimate destruction! You be nice to all your friends, Eric. Be a good share. Good shower, it'll blow up the fucking galaxies! Stupid bitch! Look, dude, we already told you, you can't play. You aren't a superhero. You don't have a costume. You don't have any superpowers. Uh, all right, look, you can watch us play superheroes as long as you don't get in the way. Make yourself useful. Go grab me the Stephanasy device. It's over there. Well, that took long enough. Is the furnace device active? <laughs> you really want to be a superhero, huh? Play with the big boys? <sighs> well, maybe. Maybe you can be useful. Have a seat at the table, douchebag. Let's see, mosquitoes, ABLs. Jesus Christ, are these even in a human language? All right, in order to play superheroes, you have to have a superhero persona. Then you can fill out your character sheet on Coonstagram. Do you have a Coonstagram page? Oh boy, you're not even on Coonstagram, huh? Well, I guess I can create one for you. Fucking unbelievable. Let's see. Speed Speedster. Might piss off Fast Pass, but sure. Brutalist. A brutalist. All bronze, no brains. A good choice for you. Blaster with range powers like Cyclops. So yeah, what an amazing moment for you. You must be excited. A speedster. Super fast and just that's about it. Just fast. Okay, douchebag, but now we need to find out what terrible thing in your past drives you. You see, douche, all superheroes have a compelling backstory. It's from that backstory that their powers gain meaning. Let's take you back to when you were just a child. You lay awake that night. Like so many other nights, you couldn't sleep because you knew you weren't like the other kids. You walked to the mirror. You walked to the mirror. You looked in the mirror and you felt alone. And that's when it happened. A loud noise. You swore you could hear your mother calling for help. You left your room. Out in the hallway, you saw two intruders in front of your parents' door. You had to stop them from hurting your parents. You knew you had the power to stop them, so for the first time, you called upon your speedster powers. 
As a super fast speedster hero, you bent space time itself to spring into action with super speed. You moved in closer to the intruder to deliver a quantum punch. Once his atoms returned to their original positions, the intruder realized what he was up against. Damn, we weren't expecting a superhero to live here. Desperately, the intruder struck our hero. Take this! Emboldened, his fellow intruder moved into the fray. You don't scare us, superhero. But the intruders were only moving closer to their demise. You vibrated every subatomic particle to become an unstoppable high-energy body. Hey, what's the kid doing now? Once charged, you became empowered to use two attacks in the same turn. First, you gave the second intruder a taste of your atom-smashing quantum fist! Get my atoms! With both intruders weakened, there was nothing they could do against the hero's final strike, a supersonic dash! Ah! Kid's too speedy! Let's get out of here! With the intruder soundly defeated, you thought you were safe, until a third massive intruder entered the fray, bigger than the other two intruders could bend! Ah! I just flushed one little shit. Here's one more. Before you could react, he swung his gargantuan fist into your small body, doing critical damage. <laughs> Exhausted from your double-edged charge, you could only watch as he continued to pummel you. Can't run away from this. You were hurt, yes, but the intruder had made a critical mistake. He pissed you off. Summoning the last of your strength, you tapped into your ultimate ability, Hammer's Face Fury. Just too speedy. And so you beat them. All seemed to be okay. But then you finally reached your parents' door. And what you saw when you opened that door changed your life forever and led you to fighting crime. You were too late. Because when you opened that door, you saw. You saw your dad fuck your mom. Wow. That's a pretty heavy backstory. You fight crime because you never forgot the night you weren't in time. And you saw your own father, the man you trusted. Fuck your mom. It's like a ripple in time you can't ever change, isn't it? All right. Now that you're a superhero, I have a mission for you. I need you to go out into town and try to get as many followers as you can on Coonstagram. It's the only way our franchise will survive. Store has just been updated. You should visit the Keenster. You're welcome.
Goofy, yes, I've heard of those. Well, isn't this fun? Oh, wonderful. I'll see you on the internet. I need more followers before I selfie with you. I'll selfie with you when you have more followers, okay? Oh, hello, new kid. I hope you're better at staying out of trouble than my little butters is. Are you on some kind of house exploring adventure? You kids have such fun. Luckily, our valuables are safely locked in our bedroom. <gasps> oh, I've said too much. I don't follow just anyone on social media. Come on. Can you help me with this thing? It's stuck. Hey, you got it open. You're the real deal, little superhero. A, a selfie? Sure, kid, let's do it. Okay, nice. Okay, I guess you're popular enough to selfie with. <laughs> Your friends new kid looks like you've reached the edge of our known universe beyond there lies the limits of time and space so you just go the other way that's what i'm saying Mutuals that we can selfie. Not bad, but hope you're gaining followers pretty fast. Keep up the good work. I'm still having trouble reaching some of the Kuhn friends. You might want to see what's going. Okay, I guess you're popular enough to selfie with. Woohoo! 
we're friends now, I guess. Mm, okay, we can get a selfie together. Cool, we follow each other now. Who would do such a thing? It's just so mean. Hey, kid, you know anything about this? Somebody's keying my wife's car at night. It's happening every night. I thought it was just one of you damn kids, but we'll... Here, come here, take a look at this. Whoever's scratching the car is also leaving notes. I'm just scared it's a jilted lover or something. You won't forget me that easy. I thought we had something. I'll tell the world about you, bitch. Listen, I'm sick of having to buff this shit out. If you can catch whoever's keying my wife's car tonight, I'll follow you on Coonstagram. Trust me, you want me as a follower. I'm a pretty big deal in this town. Hope you brought me something good, Billy. I need a Jimmy from my Peter, Billy. Can you get me a condom? I knew we could have gone to Geico. Come on, Doc. No way, turd. Your follower count is way too low. I gotta protect my hashtag brand. This is quickly escalating into an international crisis as electronic cars challenge the oil industry and transportation on behind this door. I can't fight him for obvious reasons, you know, alternative universe paradox shit. So you are going to have to take him out. You've got to really kick his ass, dude, so that he wants to return back to his universe on the East Coast. You ready? All right, go get him. Uh, zoom. Oh, hey, Kyle. I'm big. Who's your friend? Did he come to play with us? All right, me from another universe. It is time for you to go back to your universe. What do you mean, Kyle? We're a team, remember? I'm not from another universe. We're like best super pals. <laughs> As you can see, he is the one running around giving the human kite a bad name. He was sent here to destroy me and weaken my power. No, no, I came to spend two weeks with my cousin and wanted to play superheroes. And then he said, okay, what superhero do you want to be? And I said, I want to be human kite. But he said, you can't be human kite. I'm human kite. And I said, well, why can't we be human kites together? So I went to Aunt Sheila and I said, I want to be human kites together. And she told him he had to do what I said because I was the guest. Remember? I'm sorry, me from another universe, but it is time for you to learn that playing superheroes is too painful. New Kid, you must now destroy my alter ego. Oh, Jesus, we're gonna fight? That's right. If you really want to play, then this is how you do it. Well, all right. Anything to make me and my cousin more alike. Prepare for battle, weakling. <laughs> I haven't done a whole lot of sparring. Is this a no contact thing? Full contact, not sparring. Oh, I'm afraid that's impossible. I didn't bring my pants. It's happening. Get him, new kid. Cousin Kyle, we can beat him if we join forces. Yeah, I really want to, but parallel universe rules say I can't. Careful, please. I have a number of existing ailments that I don't want to exacerbate. Oh my, there's a lot of decisions in this game, aren't there? You could not play. That's a decision you could make. Oh, don't be silly. Oh, you guys, time out. My vertigo is starting to act up. Come on, dude. Oh, I'm gonna need to tell Aunt Sheila about that one. 
Okay, I think my inner ear fluids have stabilized now. Uh, that last hit didn't count, right? I'm undoing that damage, okay, Kyle? <sighs> Hold on, I need a timeout so I can use my inhaler. Watch out, new kid. Alternate universe human kite is unpredictable and extremely dangerous. Hey. Cousin Kyle, I called a timeout and he didn't listen. You know my asthma flares up when I exert myself. Right. I don't want to cause any permanent damage. Wait, I thought I should get this turn instead of the new kid because he didn't wait when I said time out earlier, so I think it should be my turn now. Are you kidding me? That's totally cheating. Oh, geez, I didn't think I'd actually hit you. Oh, geez, did you have to hit so hard? All right, here we go, my super ultimate power. Get ready. Are you ready? Oh, Jesus. Okay, Wrath Kite from an alternate universe. University. Oh, you're leaving? Dude, that sucks. Yeah, I'll be going back to my universe now, human kite. I need some camphor phonique for my ear because I got a scrape on it by being farted on. Dude, I don't know how to thank you. From now on, call on me whenever you need help. Okay, yeah, just two heroes hanging out.
Those are sixth graders. They're the most vile, evil beings known to superheroes. You guys are stupid. Everyone knows Kiefer's mom has the nicest boobs. Dude, sh sixth graders are way too powerful for you, rookie. Just keep walking. Don't even look at them. Hey, look at the stupid little four feet. Boobs. Dude, shut up about my mom's beard. When I finish kicking your butt, I'm gonna kick your stupid frog butt. Frogs don't help butts, they help Qualica. You think you can fart in my face, Forthy? You're dead. You got him on the rope. Kite's got your back. Shut up, Forthy! Okay, who's the next target of my unbridled rage? on you guys is really therapeutic for me. Titty twister! Yeah. Have your boyfriend massage that for you. Feel the wrath of human kites! Ugh. Next time I'll use my high beam. I can't say no to kicking some forthy ass. Ha! Ow. You flinched! Oh, I'm up? Okay. <laughs> ah. Welcome to Laser Town! No mercy, new kid! You really beat him! You saved me! Wow, nice work, new kid! You took down a sixth grader! Keep it up!
You really want a selfie with me? Watching you defeat that sixth grader was so cool. Maybe I can become as strong as you one day. Help Jimmy finish up his big project and sure, I'll take a selfie. Have you seen Jimmy? Are you two friends or superhero allies or something? Jimmy certainly makes some interesting friends. Interesting getup. You one of those free range kids? Don't talk to me, conformist. A selfie? Are you kidding me? Go away! I refuse to subscribe to social media agenda. I'm not really into the selfie thing. I cannot get out of here. Go away. Slow news day. I guess we're in for a quiet week. Craig's Fortress of Solitude. Super Craig hasn't checked in. I hope nothing has. 